hydrogen gas is a very clean fuel. It gives zero emission. So you could use the, the hydrogen to power fuel cells, for example, which could be used for vehicles or powering your house. So what we're seeing here are two electrodes. Okay, one is an anode, one is a cathode. And uh, it's driven by this single alkaline metal battery. And you can clearly see gas bubbles coming out from both electrodes. So we're basically using a single battery to split water into hydrogen gas and oxygen gas. It turned out we, we discovered a mixed nickel oxide and nickel metal structure, a very uh, cheap uh, materials. So this is really the first time that anyone can use like non-precious metal catalysts to split water at 1.5 volts. And this is actually quite a remarkable since uh, normally you would have to use uh, noble metals like platinum or uranium as the electrode material in order to get the voltage to that low. So this may have implications for generating hydrogen uh, from water. So I think the, the, the power of materials chemistry and nanotechnology is really, really important to future uh, energy uh, research as well as uh, applications.